Overnight's generally not a good time to trade because the spreads get wider and liquidity is not great. Um, I would say that the, 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 the clients, uh, from, from what the clients like to do, it's generally around the eight o'clock on the opening is, is a good time to be trading because you can get a sense of how the market's thinking that day. Um, 1.30 is definitely not a time to be trading because that's when the Americans come in and sh shove the market one way or the other completely randomly as far as I can see. So it's generally not good to have a position around the 1.30 time of the day unless you've got a long-term position and you and you're, you're, you're have a great big opinion. But if you're, if you're a day trader, generally be out of the market at 1.30. Um, and then hope to be out of the market um, by the Dow close, the 9, the nine o'clock close. So there'll be quite a bit of business at 8, quite a bit of business around 12.30 to 1, uh, then around the 4.30 business when the market, when the FTSE and the DAX are closing, and then there'll be another set of, mar of business around the uh, um, going home time, which is for most people is around 6 to 6.30, that's always quite busy, people don't want to get on the train and uh, with a position, although that's getting less now that the mobile is, uh, is more prevalent. Um, but even with mobiles, I know I'm on the train. It, mobile, then, you know, far. We live in apparently virtually 100% coverage in the United Kingdom, but obviously Essex isn't in the United Kingdom. So, uh, uh, and and here I've got virtually no in my house. I've got virtually no cover. So people tend to get out around 6:30, 6 to 6:30, and then there's a bit more of a, uh, a flurry around the 8:30 to 9 as people get out then. But there's no best time for making money. But there are more. Uh, uh, volume related uh, periods during the day. When you're trading the FTSE 100 and the Dow, um, the FTSE is about double the size of the Dow, so the stake size is generally about double. Uh, the FTSE average trade size is around seven pounds a point, six to seven pounds a point. The average trade size in the Dow is around three to four pounds a point, simply because the Dow, the Dow will happily move 150 points in a day as the FTSE would struggle to move more than 60 or 70 points in a day. I mean, it does move more than that, but they will move because the Dow's twice the, twice the price of the FTSE. It will generally move twice the amount.